Yo everybody, I'm making this video for my Dutch homies, uh, excuse me, as you can see we have the Wii booted up, here we have a Super Smash Bros. Brawl from the USA, and here we have the Freeloader, I've imported them both in a package deal from uh, a user on eBay called Xbyte World really good user so I recommend if you want to buy something buy it there um, it comes with a page of settings there you go Super Smash Brothers Brawl with Freeloader general settings you have to basically you have to put your TV 60 Hertz so be sure your TV supports 60 Hertz you know like the NTSC uh, settings and it's important for the first run that you get the update from the Super Smash Brothers Brawl disc so whatever you do when you get this the first time boot up your Wii as normal insert the freeloader the screen will wipe with colors twice then remove it then do the process again it will wipe with colors twice again then insert Super Smash Brothers Brawl so you got like two times the freeloader one time Super Smash Brothers Brawl and then the updates from the disc will install so and then afterwards the Wii will restart then you have to do this again because of course with the update and all so it rebooted then because I obviously I already played some time so we're gonna put in the freeloader there you go now watch the screen and don't be scared I guess you already saw this on other YouTube videos one, two, then we eject, we get it out, there you go, put this one back, if you notice, it has small balls on it, do you see it, little, little balls on it, there's one, and then we got our prize possession over here the american version i'll put that in now get my remote to the disc channel and just wait sorry for the screen blur but hey it's not my fault ka-ching there you go and then I need to get my wee hand up in this biatch there you go so of course I got my trusty lichen pad over here and uh, I guess we're ready to play okay now I'm finished like three hours later when you're done grab the Wii remote press home go Come on, go to Wii menu, yes. Now, the Paul Wii wants to read a disc again and again and again, so what you do is you go to disc channel. You just wait. See? There's an error. So now you press the eject button. You can get it out. And you're ready for the next one. And just turn the Wii off.